You are quick, Miara. What news of our enemies? Strong Griffin forces block all the major roads between us and the city of Gehenna. Our imp scouts have reported an elite unit led by Godric that snaps at our heels. Godric? I thought that Isabel would want to take my head herself. Isabel? She has departed in tears, taking her favorite corpse to its funeral. Godric has become her instrument of vengeance. And he wants you alive. So, no friendly towns, no reinforcements, and no chance to rest. Nothing like a little challenge to spice up a dull week, huh? The gates! Where is that damn tunnel on the gates to Sheon? If I hadn't used them myself, I would almost swear they didn't exist. What's this? Attacked by that scum Eraziel and his horned idiots? Oh, perhaps the Sovereign has discovered my independent mindset. That means trouble. So, Scrumming Imp, let us discuss your death. Tell me why you were here, and it will be fast. Otherwise, I shall turn you over to Miara. And it will be excruciatingly slow. Please, Erasial, refuse to talk. No! I... I was told to get two things. One is the artifact that Nikolai used in the battle, the heart of the griffin. The other is... Your head! My head? Why? The Demon Sovereign knows I am loyal. You lie! You have betrayed him and he knows! Kabaleth will protect me! He will... Yes. What will I do? Go on, please. Tell me. Give me orders. I love that. Master, I did not mean it! You fail. You lose. You pay. I know you and your ambitions. You are strong, but I am patient. You're next. What is this betrayal of which Eraziel spoke? Aren't you one of the Sovereign's most powerful agents? I will explain later. Now is not the time to talk. Now is the time to run. No. He knows I'm with you. So I am tainted by your treachery. I'm risking my life, and I deserve to know now, Agrael. If you wish. Something happened while I was undercover in Griffin lands. It made me question Kabbalah's plans. Question our sovereign? You <sighs> would consider that? Considered it and done it. Now he knows and... How does he know? Who spied on me? It doesn't matter now. Wait. He mentioned your ambitions. You want to replace him, don't you? To rule Sheog in his place? That is madness. Ah, uh, well. I should not give my plans away so easily, but... If anyone could do it, it is you. And you will remember those who helped you, yes. So what is the next step, my lord? Or should I say, my sovereign? To get the heart of the Griffin. You saw it in action. Yes, we must have that. 
I know where they keep it. In the Griffin King's mausoleum. The Hall of Heroes. It's in the middle of the Empire. Well defended. So there'll be a lot of killing. What's the bad news? You know, Biara, I'm glad I have you as an ally rather than an enemy. I am not here to kill you. I need to get the stone that lies within. A demon army is heading this way. Move aside and I will spill your blood. Demons have committed enough atrocities here, you filth. I won't be the one who betrays my dead king and lets you desecrate his tomb! Helms down! Shields up! Griffin Eternal! So my old enemy Vare and his army want to come and play, huh? So be it. It actually has brains inside. disturbs the rest. A demon. But you touch the stone, so you can't be. Approach me, stranger. You are an illusion. From where do you speak? Ah. That is why you were not affected by the stone. Interesting. Agriel, I presume. You have one up on me. And you are? Tiro. Tiro. Hmm. My former master had much to say about you. It was all quite passionate, and none of it was nice. Former master? That is reassuring news. If you have disowned the demon sovereign, why are you here? He seeks this, and I don't want him to have it. Then we share a goal. Correct me if I'm wrong, but you are high in the councils of Kabbalah. For years, I was his agent in the Griffin Empire. Then we can help each other. Karbaleth wants to destroy you. The Griffin army hunts you for killing their king. And now, something even worse comes. Worse than that? Indeed. A demon messiah. More powerful even than Karbaleth. It might mean the end of everything. We need. Each other. Where do I find you? South of the Elven capital, in Ireland. The Iris' Sea. There is an island in the shape of a crescent moon. If you live to make it that far, don't worry. I'll find you. Hurry! Well, Dead King. I think you will have a great deal of company before this comes to an end. Turn around and leave, demon. Your burning feet shall not tread our meadows. Move aside, flower sniffer. I have spoken with Tiru. I must pass through to the Iris' sea. Tiru? He is but a legend. Then your hooves will not scorch one blade of Solana's grass. True shining pixies. I don't have time for this. Kill them!
They fight well for stargazing poets. If I am going to make it to Chiru, I'll need to clear out the towns on the way. The town I needed, but not this letter. For the glory of Salam, who writes trite like this? Gilrin, of course. The stain on my honor cannot be purged, but by a ritual duel. Is this all they think about? I have more important things to do than reprimand petulant florists. Gilrin's welcome to become my enemy if he wishes. But it would do well to learn that those who make that choice seldom live to make too many others. Gentle Druids, it's harvest time! At last, the way is clear to Tiru. And the irony of having to kill so many so that I can save the world is not lost on me. You have made a mockery of me and my name. Take my head and finish it. If your name means so much to you, stay alive and restore it. Dying is the easy way out. I can't live with this humiliation. Then do it yourself. Life is too precious to be thrown away so easily, poet. One day, you might figure that out. Tiru isn't so far, but the battle's not over yet. I still need a ship, and the city of Arrow has plenty of them. So the elves are deserting, are they? Temperamental troops at best. I need some demons that I can control, and there's a Sheog outpost not too far that will do nicely. Now we're back up to strength. A few hungry demons and the shipyard is as good as mine. Shadow Dragon, what do you want with me? We harvest, we stock, we convert. You will do us a favor. I may do you a favor. What is it? And why should I help you? One hundred archers. Elves, one hundred. That will take time, and while archers are plentiful, time is not. What do I get in return? Something suitable, something for your little needs. Don't bargain. Start harvesting. You no longer command me, and your deals are always double-edged. Take our advice. Take our help. Give us elves. It will be worth your while. Yes, that was precisely what I needed right now. Soul thirsty beasts, these dragons. I can guess what will become of these elves. Shadows, shall we say, of their former selves.
like to think that the hard part is over, but somehow I doubt it. I wonder what that fog is. All the dock hands were whispering about it. Fog. They say it's alive, even hungry, and as old as Kabbalah himself. It's best that I avoid it if possible. So, could you try to explain this all to me from the beginning? Very well. In the beginning, our mother Asher created the stars from the coarse matter of the cosmic egg. No! The demon messiah! Nah, <laughs> I was just kidding. Well then, you know of the War of the Eclipse 20 years ago. Of course. The combined armies of men, elves and mages fought Kabbaleth. That's when King Alexei, Nikolai's father, died. Yes. I created the heart of the Griffin then, saving a fragment of Alexei's soul when he entered Sheog, and Karbaleth took him. Ah, the brave fool. Like father, like son. Who are you, really? A humble servant of Asher. I have spent the last two hundred years fighting the Demon Sovereign and his plans, and now, when I'm old and tired, you show up to complicate things. Not I. I am simple. I only want to defend the Griffin Empire. Then why did you lead the army that fought Nikolai? How many Griffin soldiers died with him? Come, Agriel. There cannot be secrets between us. It... It is Isabel. By Asher's eight heads. I tried to factor every force and power into my plans, and forgot the oldest and messiest one. I watched her grow up, almost from birth. Kabbalah sent me to keep an eye on her. Do you know why? He never said. He must have foreseen that she would be the queen of the Griffin Empire one day. No. There must be more to it than that. I have a guess. Enough of this, boy. What of your dire warnings? And this demon messiah? It is the greatest of Kabbaleth's efforts to bring a half-human, half-demon into the world. Unlike demons, it could remain in this world permanently. Unlike humans, it could wield the magic of Urgash. How? When? I do not know where or how. That is what I am striving to learn. So how can I help? Change. You no longer follow the demon, Sovereign. You need to free yourself from his tainted magics. This is possible? The right of true nature. It is exhausting and painful, but it will purge you. And Isabel? First, you, my friend. Then, we go to war to save the world. The world is your concern, Tiru. As I said, I am simple. I only really want to save her. You are ready? Once I start, I cannot stop. The sooner we start, the sooner I can act. Excellent.
Leopards do not change their spots, nor suck you by their alliances. <laughs> Bad decision. Bye-bye, sweetie. That was certainly effective. But the next time you see her, you better be prepared. What do you mean? I just killed her. Not at all. The heart of the griffin creates a portal. It sends the demons back to their realm of Sheog. What? You mean that all those demons that Nikolai destroyed... They were simply banished back home. So, the demon army is as large and powerful as it ever was? Precisely.